What's going on everyone? It's Noah from Snapzilla on a brand new release week. It's Monday, February the 26th. And the game that just released, at least in the US on the App Store, is Part-Time UFO by HAL Laboratory. This is the team behind uh, Kirby, Earthbound, Super Smash Brothers over at Nintendo. This game actually released in Japan uh, end of last year it says and it was under a different name I can't remember what it was called but it's now released uh, over in the US and I'm guessing everywhere else under the name part-time UFO I've just played a little bit of it and I figure I'd do a quick snapshot of it uh, so far it's really good uh, it just has that I mean I'm not a huge Nintendo fan but it does have that Nintendo feel to it basically you're a UFO looking for work on Earth and you can kind of see some of the character designs do look like Earthbound characters the game plays a lot like um, uh, the, the crane games but Right now, I played the first three levels already, but each level has little uh, side missions that you have to do. They're optional, but to get further in the game, you kind of have to do them. But controls are really easy. Uh, there's two different control schemes. There's the two-handed control scheme like I'm using right now with the joystick and button. And then there's a one-handed with, I think it's basically tapping just on the screen where you want your little UFO to go. But so far each level has been uh, time limited so out of the three missions you have to beat it within a, you know a certain time to get a star and then like in this level here the object is to get two of these orange crates into the back of the truck and the extra extras are to get the actual oranges themselves in there The little UFO, he handles a little differently with heavier objects. Which kind of makes it cool. Now I should get three stars on that one. And it doesn't look like I did. But you get paid out after each job. And then you can go into go into the shop and purchase different accessories. And some of them are basically just for looks, but there are ones like uh, the propeller hat. This one will make you float up when you grab something. Like There's a ton of them that have different abilities when you wear them. And then you can go into your little closet here and I have one outfit right now and actually got it from just tapping on the screen randomly there's a bunch of secrets in the game and they're all the levels I've played so far are all different you know like this one now you have to pick up these pillars and build a house I think I think you gotta put this little guy in the middle if uh, for like a special But 
yeah, it's actually not as easy <laughs> as it looks. This uh, character I'm using now is the first time I've used him. He actually, it could be just me, but it kind of feels like he flies a little different. I don't like it. No, no. Hopefully I can get an extra star out of that. I did it good. I think. Yes. But it won't tell you what the other, <clears throat> excuse me, the other secret little achievements or missions are. You have to kind of figure them out yourself. The one on the right's always, you know, getting it in time, but you have to kind of figure out the other ones. But yeah, see now this one, you know, you're picking up fish, so. Technically so far, yeah, it's a crane game, but it's pretty cool how they change it up this one was actually pretty tough because the things you're trying to pick up actually move and they will jump out of the crane And this is, from what I've read, this is Hal Laboratory's first uh, first stab at a uh, mobile game. Which is cool. It's a full premium game. No in-app purchases at all. No ads. Nothing to worry about. It's four bucks, which it's worth it for me, at least so far. I mean, it, to, to get a full premium game game is tough anymore without some sort of extra stuff to deal with with the in-app purchases or watching ads as far as how how long the game is I don't know if it says I'm kind of reading here as I go. It does not say. But I mean, I've played the first... Let's see, how about the cheerleaders? <clears throat> it's taken me a lot while just to play the first three levels, so... Okay, so I have to stack the cheerleaders here. Um, let's see. Oh, they have to go on. <laughs> Oops. I didn't know they had to go on the mat. so wrong. Let's see, I'll put her down. No, no! Kick her over. Let's 
steady. this one. Okay, this chick with the spread needs to get out of the way. Sorry. Didn't mean to get you in the crotch there. Well, I am going to screw up my time big time here. Up and over. Stay, stay, stay! Last one. Oh, this is going to be tough. Stay, stay. Stay. Nice. I'm pretty proud of myself on that one. First try. And I get one medal. I don't know. I'll figure that one out. Anyway, this is Part Time UFO by Hell Laboratories. It's out now on the App Store. It's 81 megabytes and it's $3.99, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure it's four bucks. I'll put the. Uh, link in the description and I'll put above that it's in this week's snap roundup under Monday so I'll put that in there also and that's it